Hi, this is the second part of e-commerce products cards. You find a link to the first part and the code of the first part in the description. In this part, I will use JavaScript to change the main image on mouse over, to hide and to show sizes and colors of products, and to check another colors of products. In HTML file, I will add a link to JavaScript file. In the CSS file, I will create a new class that hides CSS div. In this class, I will set opacity 0. In JavaScript file, I will create a variable for the element size of the first product. I will use query selector to select elements with the ID equal size 1. I will add the class height size to the element size 1. Like you see, JavaScript hides the element size. Now, I will create a variable for the first product. I will add an event listener to the element product1. I will create a variable for the main image. Inside the event listener, I will tell JavaScript to change the source of image on mouse over. I will create another event listener for product 1 on mouse out. This time JavaScript will return the first image when the mouse leaves the div of product 1. In CSS file, I will create a new class that moves the footer of card in the direction of the top. I will set transform translate y to minus 40%. Transition 0.5 second is in out. In GS file, I will create a variable for the element footer. On mouse over event, I will remove the class height size from element size 1. On mouse out event, I will add the class height size to the element size 1. Next step, I will add the class that moves the footer of the card to the top direction on mouse over. And I will remove this class when the mouse cursor is out of the product card.
In HTML file, I will give IDs to divs that contains images of colors. In CSS file, I will create a class for the active color. I will set the border to one pixel. In GS file, I will create variables for images of colors. I will add the class active to the first image of color. There is a space between the image and the border. In CSS file, I will replace the padding by margin to remove the space. In GS file, I will create variables for divs that contains images of colors. I will add comment to variables. Now I will create event listener mouse over for divs of colors. When the mouse cursor is on the first color div, JavaScript will add a border to the first image and remove the border for the second one. The event of second color div is the opposite of the first one. It didn't work. I must forget something. IDs are correct. Oh, I forget the letter E. And now it works. Next step, I will change the main image on mouse over and replace it by an image of color. The main image didn't change because we have two events listener on mouse over. The first is the event of the product card and the second is the event of divs of colors who are children of the div product so when the mouse cursor is on the div of colors it's in the same time on the div of product to solve this problem we have to exclude divs of colors from the event listener 
of the div product js file inside the event listener of divs of colors i will add the command event point stop propagation now when i put the cursor on divs of colors the event listener of product card doesn't apply the footer return to its position when the cursor is on colors div to resolve this problem i will copy and paste the part of code that shows the size div and moves the footer into the colors divs events now it works correctly Zalando disable the effect for small devices in the CSS file inside the media smaller than 950 pixels I will set the opacity of size to zero and I will set the transition Y of the class footer up to zero now the size div is hidden and the footer didn't change the position on the small devices for the other products card you can duplicate the code or think about a solution to add event listener with loops and arrays this is the end of this video thank you for watching